Hey Parasites and welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog and I am actually out, outside where they're filming Venom 2 right now. Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog. And today we have uh, two episodes I'm going to record real quick. And, uh, you know, just while I have the energy, because I was like, you know, online and I saw some people tagging me and some stuff on Twitter. Uh, and uh, I got to meet uh, someone named Kirsten, who uh, works for The Insider. And I think we covered a couple of her articles before. And it was really awesome because she was like, hey, Venom Vlog, that sounds like a cool name. And then, uh, and then you know, I, I chimed into the comments and uh, she did an interview with Sean Delaney, who was someone that we talked about about two months ago on this, maybe a little more than two months ago now. On the show, uh, we put, posted a picture of him in his police uniform that we got on his Instagram. And turns out, you know, I don't know if that got him in trouble. I hope it didn't, man, because that's not obviously what I'm trying to do here. I just saw information. I was like, hey, let's share it. Uh, but then he, you know, he took that post down like the day after our video went up. So uh, so anyway, you know, that was kind of confirming him playing a police officer in Venom 2. And so there's a, a nice little article with him where he gives some movie details, how it's currently on track to still release in October, that he, as far as he knows. But then also Kirsten went and confirmed that, um, you know, with Sony. She reached out to someone at Sony and they said, yeah, as of right now, the movie's still planned for October which we've been taught, we've been saying that on the show, as far as I know, I kept saying that, like, as far as I know, the movie hasn't moved, and that's only because I haven't seen any updates anywhere officially saying that they're pushing it back. Um, and then he also mentioned that it might have shut down during post-production, which a lot of other articles and, and other sites were posting that the movie, uh, you know, sh shut production down while filming, and I kept you know, trying to correct them. And uh, these bigger websites are like, what do you know? You're just a small site. And it's like, all right, dude. Well, okay, fine. I don't know anything, I guess. Well, this article now confirmed. So thank you, Kirsten. Uh, she confirmed that it uh, looks like the movie, or, you know, according to, uh, you know, Sean's, you know, comments, of course. Uh, but it, he said, hey, it looks like the movie might have shut down during post-production, but I think they're still editing it remotely. So again, that you can take with a grain of salt. That's what I heard. I don't know if that's true or not, uh, but I think they're still trying to get some stuff done on the movie. But there's not going to be any trailer stuff, any of that information right now, as far as I know. So we just got to be a little bit patient. But we do have some news. I did some digging on IMDb, and I figured we could talk about some of this. So what I have here is uh, the first uh, thing I want to talk about is really quick. It's uh, confirming that uh, Erwin uh, Felicilda, and I'm so sorry if I'm um, uh, Felicilda, if I'm um, butchering your last name, I, I so apologize, uh, Erwin. Um, he is listed, he's added as the cast member uh, for someone named, uh, you know, the Carnival Adult, I guess. He's always like a, you know, a small character, maybe in the background in one of the scenes. But we had talked about maybe the carnival being a big thing, like a big deal of the movie, because the movie, you know, we saw, I noticed that a couple people who were filming in San Francisco, I would see people like extras walking by in Halloween costumes. And I'm like, what's up with that? And then our, our friend Rob, who, you know, works at the uh, the zombie bar over at, uh, you know, where we were filming when I went to visit the set, um, he posted and sent me a picture of some signs that were up on his street uh, and in, in the streets nearby that talked about a carnival that was coming up. And so that puts the movie, you know, the setting of the movie around Halloween. And uh, and so that's pretty cool. So like a Halloween type setting. And, uh, and so the carnival looks like it's going to be a big place or a big part of that story. And I started theorizing that maybe the ending of the movie would take place at the carnival. Um, or who knows, maybe it's just a flashback scene or I don't know. It's not, probably not a flashback scene because it's, it's happening while Eddie's driving around his motorcycle. So, um, I'm guessing it's something that's kind of peppered throughout the movie. So I don't know if there's going to be a scene, you know, in the big, you know, middle of the movie that takes place at the carnival, or if it's going to be like the final, you know, act, the final battle. Uh, because some people were theorizing that it might be at the church. I'm thinking the church might be like a third act thing, maybe, um, or it could be a second act thing. I don't know with Venom on the Run with uh, Anne Wang. Uh, so I don't know fully what's going on over at the church, but uh, th that's a possibility. That could be, you know, a big ending battle for the movie or the carnival could be. So this kind of confirms that at least the carnival has a setting and there's going to at least be a scene there uh, because now we have someone listed as a carnival adult. Uh, so that's pretty awesome. And I know we should always take IMDb posts uh, with a little bit with a grain of salt, but they are right a lot of times. As we saw with season one of the show, we were pulling stuff from IMDb and uh, most of the time it was right. I think one or two times we saw that it was someone editing stuff, but for the most part, hasn't been happening a lot with this second movie uh, so far that I've seen. So, and the person who edited in the first one, they haven't reached out to me in this one and, and told me that they were messing with stuff. I think they kind of chilled out and just let things, you know, get posted when they get posted. So, uh, so that's awesome. So, Erwin, you know, uh, you know, welcome to the Venom family. Welcome to the Parasites. Uh, you know, I can't wait to see the movie. Can't wait to see what part you play. And also 
can't wait to see what scene happens at the carnival. So let's start theorizing. Let me know down in the comments below what you think, and we'll continue our conversation as always down there. I got one more video for you guys, uh, and it's going to be a pretty good one because I think it's kind of a scoop in a way. Like it's a, it's about an actor who uh, has not been announced to be in the film right now, and I think it's pretty cool. And I looked into the, who this actor was, and I'm very excited to talk about them in the next episode. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out. Thanks so much. See you in the future. Peace.